What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. I'm back with another mod tutorial for you guys. I hope everyone is having a good day. Today, I will be showing you how to install the Vice City Map Remastered for GTA 5 or Vice Cry as it's called. Now, we will be needing a couple of things for this mod to work. But first off, I'm going to leave a link to this website right here, gtainside.com. This is where we're going to be downloading our Vice Cry from today. So let's get into the requirements that we're going to need to download this mod. We're going to need a few things. First off, we're going to need Open 4. And then we're going to need Game Config. All right. We're going to need Heap Adjuster, Pack File Limit Adjuster, and this Fix the Collisions and Mini Maps. All right. So go ahead and make sure you download each of those and make sure you have open for installed as well. And then you can go to your GTA inside and download your Liberty City 5 Remix. This is what we're going to be downloading. After we have it downloaded, we're going to have a folder right here, Liberty City V Remix. Let's open it up. Let's open up the next folder. And you're gonna see a text document that says download LC maps links. Click on that. Okay, and what you wanna do is you wanna scroll down until you see Vice Cry. You wanna highlight it and open up that link. And then you wanna download that link, all right? After that, what we wanna do is we wanna open up the folder that should say Liberty Cry Remix and Vice Cry West. Let's open it up. And we're going to have a lot of files here. Now, what we want to do is we want to first off, actually, let's make sure we have a mods folder. Let's in our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. If you do not have a mods folder, create one now and name it mods. All right. Now, let's go back into our Vice Cry folder and we want to take this Vice Cry East original map, this OIV file. It should be an OIV file. And now what we want to do is open up our open four. All right, when we get into open four, just turn on edit mode and leave it right here. What we're going to do is we're going to take our Vice Cry East original map OIV file and we're going to drag and drop it right here. A package installer window will pop up and it will ask you if you want to install, select install. Select mods folder and then click confirm installation. All right, after we've done that, let's go ahead and minimize out of open four for now. Let's go back. Let's go into our fix the collisions folder. We're going to have one OIV file in that folder. Let's take that file, open up our open four again, drag and drop it into open four. Oops, I don't have edit mode turned on, excuse me. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and drag and drop it into open four. Another package installer window will pop up, fix for mini maps, select install, mods folder, and confirm installation. All right, now what we want to do is we want to open our heap adjuster any folder. We're going to have two files in that folder. Let's take both of those files and let's drag and drop it into our main Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. I already have it installed, so I'm not going to replace it. And now let's go back into our Vice City folder where we installed it earlier. And we're gonna have a Vice City folder at the top, all right? Now, what we wanna do in our mods folder, in our main directory, we wanna open up that mods folder. We wanna go to update, X64, DLC packs, Vice City. And you're gonna have one DLC file, all right? When you open up your Vice City folder right here, where we downloaded it earlier, you're going to have two DLC files. My folder is empty because I already added it. You're going to have two files here. You want to drag and drop them right here into your Vice City folder right here in your DLC packs. And then you should have three just like I have right here. All right. All right. 
Now, what we want to do is we want to go into our game config. Let's go into GTA config. And then we're going to have for more mods and for less mods. I encourage you guys to select for more mods. And we're going to have a lot of folders here. Now, what you want to do is I suggest just so that you don't experience any game crashes or any uh, load up errors that you select one of the lower options. And it varies from whatever PC you might have. If you have a lower end PC, I would suggest selecting one of the lower ones. If you have a high end PC, you see, you can select more, but just so that you don't have any errors, I do suggest that you select one of the lower ones, such as two times traffic, two times pet. So any one of these you can install, it's completely up to you. If you are experiencing game crashes, go ahead and try a lower one. And yes, yeah, so what I'm gonna do for this video is I'm just gonna select this one right here. And we're going to have a game config file. Let's open up our open four. We wanna go to mods, update, update.rpf. Oh man, let me make my, I have my edit mode on. We wanna go to common, data. And right here is where we want to drag and drop our game config. All right, all right. Let's go back. And now what we wanna do is we wanna open our pack file limit adjuster. Let's open up our main Grand Theft Auto 5 directory again. And let's take pack file limit adjuster and pack file limit adjuster.asi and let's drag and drop it into our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. I'm not going to replace it. I already have it installed. And after we've done that, we are all done installing Vice Cry Remastered or Vice City Remastered, whichever one you prefer. We can go ahead and close everything out and let's go ahead and run the game. All right, once we spawn in the game, let's go ahead. Let me walk outside. What we want to do is we want to go on our pause menu now. And you're going to see a airplane marker right here. It should say fly to Vice City. Let's go ahead and teleport there. I'm using menu to teleport there. You can use menu as well or any available trainer that you like. And I'm just going to teleport so you guys that we can now go to Vice City. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to walk into this green marker right here and it's going to give you an instruction to fly to Vice City. It says press E. You want to press E. And now we will be flying to Vice City. On a luxury jet. <laughs> yeah. Screen will fade out and it will fade back in when you land in Vice City. So if you are experiencing any game crashes, I encourage you to try a different game config. Sometimes the PCs just can't handle it. So try one of the lower ones or you can mess around until you find one that works well for your PC. Okay. So once your pilot lands in Vice City, you can now cruise around the city and do whatever you like. And there is a lot of interiors bars nightclubs all that good stuff so yes this this mod is definitely very good all right let's go ahead and hop into this car that we have here and let's drive around vice city a little bit and so we can see how pretty vice city really is let me uh make it let me change the time make it like that sunset sunset time yeah that's what that's what i'm talking about and now we can cruise around vice city and we have traffic we have people walking around nice sunset buses all that good stuff man cabs and we
we have plenty interiors like i said earlier you can explore them yourself so much to offer it's a lovely mod man this is this is such a good mod man shout out to the creators let's go ahead and take a look at that ocean let me get that sunset back <laughs> I just love that sunset. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That is beautiful. Welcome to Vice City. We are back in Vice City. Us modders, man, we're ready for GTA 6, man. You know the mods for GTA 6 are gonna go crazy, man. And this is how you install Vice Cry or Vice City Remastered. If this helps you, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you can be notified when I upload on the channel. I love you guys, man. And I will see you in the next video. Peace. Let me spawn me a boat for y'all to end the video off. I think that would be a sick way to end the video. Let me spawn me a boat. Spawn. Nice little speed boat. Yeah. <laughs> all right all right frank is gonna cruise and i see y'all around